Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. It's Agnes Smith again. Today I'm going to show you how to make a pepper steak. So these are the ingredients I have. Um, I have the steak on right here. I have a diced onions, green pepper that we're gonna dice it later. I have la choy bean sprouts but usually um, I use fresh bean sprouts but it's hard to find so for now I'm using the la choy um, bean sprouts in a can and I will need a soy sauce and Worcester sauce that's the ingredients for today and also for the steak um, you can also use thin cut ribeye steak but for my husband, he preferred for me to use the steak and sliced steaks, the frozen one. Okay, let's begin. So now I'm going to prepare my pepper. So now we're going to prepare the green pepper. And also before I begin, I forgot to show you when you try to cook green pepper always get the four corners four corners means for cooking okay so now all you have to do is dice the green pepper cut them in squares just like that This is my one of my hobby's favorite dish. And this recipe is came from my in-laws, mother-in-law from Pennsylvania. So this is what you do with your pepper. Cut it into squares. And now I already cut my green pepper. And I already have this bean sprout in the can ready. And now we're going to prepare the steak. Um, all you have to do is cut this in squares. And make sure you don't let this thaw out. Just like that. When you cut this, make sure it's still frozen and don't let it thaw out. Because once it's thaw out, it's a mess. It's hard to cut. That's the tip for this one. Okay? So make sure this is frozen when you cut it. Because once it's thawed out, thawed out it's hard to cut. So as you can see, it's still frozen. Just cut it like that in the squares. Okay, that's how easy it is. Still cutting it. On the steak, um, guys, there is like uh, 14 pieces and 21. But these are the 14 pieces. We have some left for the 21 pieces. So these are all 14. So let me see if my, okay. My pot is ready, so now I'm going to add a, add a little bit of oil, just to start. And then just make sure you just go like this, so the oil will even out in the pan. And then you add your sliced steak on. And then all you have to do is just mix it and wait till it turns brown. And once this turns brown, that's when we are going to add our onions. And as you can see, when while we're cooking this meat, the meat will shrink while you're cooking it. So just wait till it turns brown. 
Okay, now just um, continue to, to cook the meat until brown, about two minutes, depending on how much meat you use. And now it's already brown. We're going to add the onions. Now I'm going to add my onions. And just cook it until it's soft. Mix it with the meat. Now I'm going to add my soy sauce. And now I'm going to add Worcester sauce. I'm going to add one tablespoon. And now just once you put your soy sauce and your Worcester sauce, just continue mixing. And now Add the green peppers. And once this is done, always put last the bean sprouts. Just stir it evenly. And I'm just going to um, cover it up so the pepper will cook evenly. Let's wait. So now my my green pepper is ready, and I'm going to add the bean sprouts. And then just continue to mix. You know the bean sprout is already cooked, so it will not take a while to get done. Just probably do it for like a minute. Okay. And now let me check my food. This is done. And also this one, you can pair this and put it on top of your rice. Okay, everyone, here's my pepper steak. It's already done. And this is the rice. You can put this on top of your rice. Okay, guys, here's the finished product. And you can put this on top of your rice. It's looking delicious. Well, again, thank you guys for watching my video. I hope that I hope you um, think of a dish that you wanted to cook. An easy dish for your family. This is the pepper steak. Um, don't forget to put your comment down below. And if you have any question, just ask, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Again, thank you for my thank you for watching on my channel. And until next time, again, hope you enjoy it. Goodbye.